Ahoy mateys, it's the Cursed Captain here, really excited to talk to you about the new combat changes inside of the Sea of Thieves. So pull up your ship, come aboard, and let's have our pirate conversation. Fluid swordplay is here, and it is here in force. This is an amazing change to how the cutlass works. You no longer slow down when you swipe your sword, and it gives you a lot more mobility. In other words, if you don't have the cutlass assigned as one of your weapons, you are in a world of hurt. Time to sharpen your blades, mates, and get ready. Bonus, the advanced sword lunge still works, so you do not have to worry. You can still master the sword lunge and make it a weapon in your arsenal. Here. You can no longer cycle between weapons for an instant kill. Not only is double gunning now officially gone forever, there is now a brief wielding animation that happens for the flintlock, the eye of reach, and the blunderbuss. It takes some time to get used to it, but I'm excited for these new changes as I think it will add to some more intense standoffs. These new animations also look great, so that is a bonus. In this update, we see some new changes to the reloads and the reload speeds. Specifically, the guns are reloaded the moment the hammer is pulled back, rather than when that pesky reload animation was finished. This helps fix a lot of the issues pirates were running into when they thought their weapon was ready to go, when in fact it wasn't. Other changes to take note is the new reload times. I have them here side by side for comparison. Now, let's talk about the Eye of Reach for just a moment. There are some significant changes that have happened to this weapon that I want to touch on. First, hit firing with this weapon has been significantly changed, and in my opinion, for the better. You still have an opportunity for that miracle shot with a hit fire, but it is no longer reliable to hit fire with an Eye of Reach. Second, with the Eye of Reach came another change, damage. The Eye of Reach no longer does 80% damage, and it now does 70% damage per bullet. Which means, to bring down another player with a sword and Eye of Reach combo, it now takes two swipes of your sword to bring them down. My good friend No Play Jack made a great graphic that I will link in the description below. It shows all of the weapon damages on the fly, and it's a great thing to have on hand. Another thing to note is bullet velocity changes are here for the Eye of Reach and the Blunderbuss. What this means for you is that the Eye of Reach is now deadlier at a distance and is easier to land shots. This puts the Eye of Reach in a deadly category when you consider shots from a distance. For the Blunderbuss, the changes make the weapon feel more powerful and the feedback from the tracers have been updated. Another thing to make note here is that there's no more damage weapon scaling from a distance. I actually did not know that this was a thing, but apparently it is. Well, it was. Anyways, this means your shots from a distance are even more powerful, which is great news all around. The only weapons that will have knockback going forward are the Cutlass and the Blunderbuss. Knockback has been removed from the Flintlock and the Eye of Reach. This also applies to our friends the Skellies. The only difference is Skellies with the wonderful Blunderbuss also will not have Knockback. It is a change that will affect combat on the seas and close quarters combat. Something to make note of is we tested this out on a ship to see if a flintlock would knock someone off a ladder. It did not. The only thing that will knock someone off the ladder is the blunderbuss or the sword combo.
overall, I am very excited for these changes. I personally was getting a bit tired of the Eye of Reach sword combo and the Devil Gunning Plague that was in the Sea of Thieves. These changes seem to be adding variety once again to our weapon combos and I could not be more excited to see what new fights await me out on the seas. Special shout out to everyone who helped me make this video and if you liked what you saw make sure to subscribe it really means a lot to me One more time one more time Oh snap <laughs>